to board. the chair of the board. Okay, so yeah. let's talk about them a little bit. Well, you know what? As a teacher, I saw the great things. I mean, I think we've all seen, and we probably don't even know we see it, that some of the solutions poster that's in bathrooms and everywhere, this is all the crisis numbers. And a few years ago, I was looking to get involved in something. And they're, they're just such a fantastic organization. They take care of, you guys don't know, they do like the suicide helpline, the emergency crisis line. They have about youth in need. And uh, so I reached out to their executive director at the time, uh, Mr. Jason King. I said, hey, you, are you looking for board members? And he's like, yeah, cool. Let's have a meet. Let's have a chat. We talked. And that was about three years ago. And then uh, I met with the uh, current board chair at that point, And we had a chat. And I said, you know, this would be a great fit. If you're ever looking for somebody, let me know. My skill sets. And they're like, yeah, we'll come in sense of board meetings and join the board. Mm. So I was a member at large for about 11 months. Like I got a full board member. And then uh, the opportunity came up to take over the chair role. And I jumped into it. And uh, it's great. You know, cause this, this community has been so good to me. This community has given me so much. And I'm so blessed. I think we're all blessed to have what we have here. But with that, I think there's that opportunity and that need to give back. So with some of the solutions, they're such a great organization, and I feel so privileged to be part of them. And, like, I give back with school. I see kids grow. I give back with my music. I like to try to give back with this, this organization with some of the solutions. And it's, it's just been such a great experience, and I'm hoping I got a long, long time with this group. Um, so I'm some broken now that this show's over. I need another one. Talk about quenching your ugly thirst. Yeah.